Today we're hunting scammers in Los Angeles, California with a little extra holiday twist. With over a dozen hidden cameras in two separate sting locations, we're baiting online scammers into our trap where they think they're coming to steal hundreds of thousands of dollars from innocent victims. In this video, we're taking you along for the scam baits, the stings, the cat and mouse games, and even the chases that will leave these scammers begging for mercy. It's the holiday season. It's the holiday season. And while the world is celebrating, there's a sinister plot unfolding in the shadows. While online scams are continuing to run rampant, we at Trilogy Media are combining our festive spirit with the thrill of the chase. We're setting up not one, but two traps for one of our most daring operations yet. We're hunting the snakes in the grass, the cash mules of the notorious refund scam. Our team of scam baiters, the unsung heroes in this digital battleground, are about to face their toughest challenge yet. Gone are the days where the mules would just blindly walk right into our traps. They've grown very skittish, wary of the spotlight that we've shown on their murky world. With dozens of busts and millions of viewing eyes, we've made it infinitely more difficult for these overseas scammers to take money out of the hands of our elders. That's the good news. The bad news is they're continuing to evolve and devise new sinister methods to get money out of the hands of innocent victims. The target for this mission is the refund scam. It's a scam that begins with the victim calling about a charge they received via a spam email, only to be led through a devious progression of smoke and mirrors on their own computer to make the victim think that they've been over-refunded for said charge. The scammers then demand that money be paid back immediately. Money that was never there in the first place. Money they are effectively stealing out of the hands of grandmothers who are just trying to do the right thing. This scam is particularly evil because it relies heavily on emotional pressure and large payouts for the scammers. This isn't just a quick buck for the scammers where they have you go to the store and get $100 in gift cards in order to remove a virus from your computer. This is an entire technical charade that results in tens, sometimes hundreds of thousands of dollars being stolen. These scammers aren't targeting a quick buck. They're targeting people's entire life savings. And the sick part is they're succeeding. So as elaborate and insane as some of these things you're about to see are, keep in mind that despite our aim to drip humor into an ocean of darkness, these are real scams and real scammers that are using technical prowess and emotional manipulation to ruin people's lives every single day. So for today's mission, we've recruited the help of an entire team of scam baiting fraud fighters. We have scam baiters working tirelessly behind the computer, pretending to be victims that the scammers think that they can manipulate. We've got Chappy Gray, victim liaison and queen of verbal scammer evisceration. And we've got our team here at Trilogy Media, standing by and waiting with caffeine, cameras and questions, ready to hold these cash mules accountable for their shady activities. As I've already said, it is getting infinitely harder to get these cash mules to actually show up. And that's hugely credited to all of the amazing work of everybody in the scam baiting community. We have confronted dozens of cash mules, removing them from the circuit, wasting hundreds of hours of scammers time and millions of dollars lost by the scammers. And let's not forget, please, that's the goal here. We aren't cops, we cannot arrest people. And we've done this enough times to know that law enforcement involvement on the day, even with the best intentions, is utterly useless when we're dealing with an international crime ring and bait money that never existed to begin with. We're not here to prosecute. It's great when it happens, but it's completely out of our control. We create exposure, deterrent, and strip these scammers of their tools one by one. And if we can make you laugh a little bit along the way, that's a bonus. Our first confrontation is scheduled for tonight at this Hilton Hotel in Culver City, California. We've got this hotel room rigged with hidden cameras, but given the increased reluctancy of mules to actually approach any kind of door, we're rigged and ready with mobility to cover as many outcomes as possible. Our first target is scammer Ryan Davis, baited by Mater Paul from this fake invoice from McAfee. Thank you for connecting with McAfee. How can I help you, ma'am? Uh, yes, I got an email in from McAfee for a total of $459.63. Thank you for the lovely patience. You are speaking to Ryan Davis, and I am the general manager from the billing department. How are you doing today? This is one of the many examples of what's called the refund scam. It's a scam that we've covered ad nauseum on this channel. And although the roadmap can differ from call center to call center, the crux of the scam is the scammer gaining remote access to the victim's computer and convincing them that they've been refunded too much money. The scammers oftentimes will have the victim log into their own bank early on in the scam. So the scammers can get a glance at the victim's financial status thus plotting how much money they're going to be able to steal. My first name is Karen, last name is Paige. That money you are going to receive 
in about two hours from now. All right. This scam relies heavily on the ability to edit HTML of web pages, particularly the victim's online banking page. HTML editing can be done by anybody using your browser's inspector tool to temporarily change the appearance of any web page. It's a tool meant for web developers, but it's commonly abused by fraudsters who want to pull a trick on technologically inexperienced victims. Now you go and type the amount, 200. $200? Okay. Now, scam baiters like Modern Paul are using virtual machines and fake bank accounts, which is what allows them to string these scammers along with no danger to anyone's real computer or financials. And it makes for the perfect venue for the scammers to execute what they think is an effective trick. In this case, a display of a $200,000 overpayment to the victim. Have you typed the amount $200? Yes, I did. I think that you made the spelling mistake. Online banking, they don't require dot com. Oh my goodness. Just hold down. I think that you made the major huge blunder mistake. Do you see that? Of course, they throw in some top tier gaslighting to make the victim feel guilty as if it's their fault. Oh my goodness, it says $200,000. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my boy. goodness, what oh have boy. you done? Oh my goodness, that yeah. money is credited into your account. Do you see that? And I'm yeah. not blaming you that you did that intentionally i'm going to lose my job how i'm going to pay this much of money to my director i will be going to guide you that how you're going to return my company money what we have sent you extra we're gonna guide you on how you can return that money this is the crux of the scam where we at Trilogy Media come in. The scammers want to get as much money as they can out of the victim's hands, as clean, untraceable, and irreversible as possible. This is why they use money mules. Money mules assist the scammers by moving the money from one place to another. This can be done virtually, meaning the money mule receives a wire transfer here in the States and then converts it and transfers it to the bosses overseas. Or this can be done in person, which is our personal favorite. The scammers will send local cash mules who are in on the scam to pick up these stolen funds in cash giving us the opportunity to catch them in the act and confront them. I want you to go to the bank and make an international physical wire the information which I'm going to say you. You're supposed to get for 99.99, right? That what I want you to deduct that money from that 200,000 and send it only 199,500. Okay, got it. Now, your bank they're going to ask for what purpose that you wanted to send this money to this account. Do right. not say by a personal mistake over money credited because I got a call from McAfee. If your bank comes to know for your personal mistake over money credited and you making a personal transactions to a business account, they're going to charge 20% on top of that. 199,500. So be careful, okay? And do not discuss anything to your husband. If he comes to know, he's going to upset. As you can probably tell, a lot of work goes into the lead up to these confrontations. You can probably imagine that these in-person pickups are very high risk for the scammers and the mules, and for us too. So they typically want to do this as a last resort. They'll first try for wire transfers, Bitcoin deposits, or straight up mailing cash in a box. You trying me to rip out my company money, correct? Of course not. Now what do you see on the computer? It says I have a zero balance. I got your money, which you yeah. earned from your whole life. More than 450,000. Now without okay. my director's signature, not even your bank going to help you out to get your money back. You just took all my money. What else can I do? I mean, you're so powerless to you. I'm ready to go to the, to the bank. All right, put me on speaker and do not disconnect me. I will be there over the phone all the time. But scam baiters like Ray are genius at creating reasons why those things can't happen. It takes a lot of time and a lot of patience. But when it works, mm. Are you home? I have money at home. I can I can take cash and go to like a Wells Fargo. I can get a certified check and mail it to you. Wait. Wait. How much gas you have in your house? Um, I should I should have more than enough to cover what I owe you. What I'm going to do, I am sending 
my guy to your house he going to collect the hard cash 199500 so that you're not going to pay no tax you're not going to say nothing to nobody all right tonight <clears throat> i'm taking a plane to go to california for some in service training for my job what time you want me to send our guy i got to call my supervisor and find out where they're going to have me located and then i can get back to you i'll text you the address you need to take a pictures of that cash and send it to this number along with your driving license i can do that i got to go have a safe journey safe I will. journey we're checked into this hotel it's rigged with hidden cameras all we're waiting for now is a scammer to walk right into our trap hello Hi, I'm trying to reach Ryan. Yes, you're speaking with Ryan. How can oh. I help you, ma'am? Hi, Ryan. This is Samantha. How are you? Yeah, hi, Samantha. How are you? I'm okay. We're we're in and out of training room, so it's just crazy. I said, did, tell me, did you get the um, did you get the address I sent you? No, I did not got the address. So right, let me do like, it again. Let me tell me. Okay, do it again. I just sent it again. You were busy, right? Yeah, we're in training. but i am going to be uh, i'll have 2 hours tonight from 5:30 to 7:30 five that, that, to 7:30 right yeah yeah i'll be in the hotel then uh, okay okay i just sent you the address when you're on your way i'll uh, i'll send you the room whenever i'll call you just do receive my call that's it if i'm okay? in a meet if i'm not in a meeting i will if i'm in a meeting i can't okay i understand i there was a lots of problems you were facing with but i promise you there would be no more problems from now onwards okay it's my promise to you so i have given the address to my company okay. and they they are just searching it so they will search it and how long it will take uh, it will take i'll text you okay okay well like you. i said i'll be there for 2 hours from 5:30 to 7:30 or oh, you're going to stay in 2 hours No, I okay. will be there. I'll be at the hotel. Those are the two hours I have available. Oh, you have sent me the address of the hotel, right? Yes. Yep. Okay. So I'm sending the person, and how long the person will take? I'm giving you the report within ten minutes. Okay. 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 Just let them know the time, though. I won't be there other than those two hours, five thirty to seven thirty. Five thirty to seven. Okay. Let me confirm it when the person is gonna come. Okay. Okay. Please let me confirm. Right. Okay. Okay. I'll thanks. call you right back, Samantha. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye. Before things get intense at our Hilton Sting operation, I want to first thank Guardio for being Trilogy Media's exclusive sponsor and cybersecurity partner. If you've watched any of our videos recently, you've probably heard us say go to guard.io/trilogy a couple two or three thousand times. But take just a moment and think about why. Our entire brand rests on the foundation of exposing fraud and confronting shitty people. Our entire reputation is dependent on us promoting things with integrity. We as a company have opted to partner with one single brand that we trust, rather than throwing 69 different sponsorships in your face every video. We've been partnered with them for a year now and many more to come. And in just this short time, they've added so much value to their product that it's truly mind-boggling. If only we had time to do Russian Grinch. Yeah, I know. I I thought about it too. I know. Great. I got a uh, money mule with an S and then a uh, naughty sock. Little bit naughty sock. Little naughty sock. Again. So we're giving him coal. And you're going to give it to him and he has to take it. <laughs> so, uh, SC S scammer? SC Flip it. Scam. Scam. <laughs> Guardio is your one-stop shop. to online safety in so many ways that I, I don't even have time to mention them all in this integration. What I can say is that online dangers are rampant and they're not going anywhere. Browsing the internet without any kind of protection or bodyguard in your browser is like leaving your front door open when you sleep at night. Real-time browsing protection, which by the way is as important as ever right now with all the holiday shopping scams. If you're like me right now, you're doing all your Christmas shopping last minute and there are fake shopping websites everywhere trying to trick you into thinking they're real so they can get your credit card information. In most cases it's almost impossible possible to tell which one is fake and which one is real but if you have guardio it will identify fake sites and block them right away i want to get here do you need a you want a little more oh yeah there we go perfect and browsing protection is just the start guardio monitors the dark web for data leaks and alerts you immediately if any of your credentials have been leaked by a big company and this is critical to know so you know which accounts are linked to those and you can go change those passwords like right now and more recently guardio just added real time browsing protection for mobile as well as malicious email alerts anytime a spam email bypasses your spam folder <laughs> look like i'm like 
<laughs> Somebody read me off. <laughs> Your wish.com Santa. Oh my god, all right. That's perfect. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Chestnuts. You look ridiculous. That's perfect. Good. And even more recently, Guardio has just added a new patented feature that protects your social media accounts from being hacked. I shit you not, I get at least 20 emails per week from people asking me to help them recover their stolen Facebook or Instagram accounts. Hackers don't need your password to bypass two-factor authentication with malware. Guardio now includes built-in anti-account hijacking protection so that all logins to Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and other accounts are completely protected from being hijacked. Do that again, I just said, where's your beard? And he does this. No, it doesn't go there. No? <laughs> look at the box. Look at it. That's where it goes, not on your garage. Yeah, but it's like, look how much hair. And what is this? The left Because it's from the what dollar store or some hair. shit. Them. Oh my god. god. Yeah. Them. You know what? Them. Leave it there. I love that. Yeah, like that. <laughs> no, that is not right. <laughs> not even. There's a hole there. Let me see. I don't know how it'll. But. And. Because it's Stupid. tight, it doesn't need it's to go It's so up. tight, dude. It, yes, the tightest. Then don't, need to then, go there. then don't wear it. Ba, ba, ba. You're gonna show up like this, like you would never knew who bossed him like this. Yeah, you're gonna run into people. <laughs> that is the stuff of nightmares. <laughs> what? This is how I'm gonna run like this. You have boot covers on with no boots. <laughs> you look so <laughs> stupid. <laughs> Our personal link to Guardio is guard.io slash trilogy. It gets you 20% off and seven days to try it completely free. No risk. They'll even alert you two days before your trial is over. Guardio is legit and they've got over a million users. So give it a shot. You've got nothing to lose. Type guard.io slash trilogy or simply click the link in the description below and secure your online life before it's too late. I told you I was going to call you in two minutes, and you texted me like ten times. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. My manager was disturbing me. I'm so sorry. That's okay. That's me. okay. I'm in room 718. Okay. 718. Sorry, ma'am. I'm in room 718. Ma'am, please, you can do one thing. You can come outside. No, nope, no. Nope. Please. No, nope, I'm not going outside. Okay, tell me the room number. 718. And I already, I asked the front desk, they said it's no problem. I told them I had somebody coming up, and uh, they said that's fine. Ma'am, if you can go out. I just said no. Yep, yeah, so 718 is the room I'm in. And the building, num the hotel number, the hotel name I gave you, it's right, right? Yeah, it, you said he's here. It's a Hilton. 718, have him say uh, the password, chestnuts. I just want to make sure I'm giving it to the right person, and I'll hand him yes, the password. Yes, he will give me the password. Okay, He'll tell him. The, I'll give you the password. No, I just gave you the password. It's chestnuts. Sorry? Chestnuts. You know, like Christmas time? Ches chestnuts? Like Christmas yes. time? Spell it out. I'll put it in. You want me to text it to you? You've never heard of chestnuts at Christmas time? Like chestnuts roasting yeah. on an open fire? Yeah, yeah. Just text okay. me that. Okay, I'm here. I got I to gotta get on a conference call. So I'm going to get as long as... What does he look like? I'll, I'll, I'll give you his, like, his name. I've given you his name. I'll tell you his, like... He's not so tall, and uh, what's his name? He, he's not so tall. He's not so tall. Okay, he's not too tall. What is his name, though? You said his name. I, I have sent you. See, I have sent you a text. You check. Oh, okay. Yes, I, I see it. Not. Josh. Josh. Yes, Josh. Right. Okay. Yes. All right. Have him come on up. It's not a problem. I told the front desk um, that I had somebody coming up, and they said okay. Oh, okay. Do you know what he's wearing? I mean, I, I, don't, tell you. I don't think anyone's going to knock on my door that's not him, but just in case. Okay, I'll tell you. Okay. He's waiting for you for more than one hour. I don't care. Downstairs. That's your problem. I told you what time to be here. That's not my problem. I do. I, right. I okay. told him also. Right. So 718 and Josh, all he has to do is say chestnuts and he can have his package. Yeah, I'm just telling him to come in, okay? Okay. What is he wearing? I'm telling you. Okay. I'm telling you. He must have hung up. I don't know what's going on. Hello. All right, go sit down hey and guys, chill. Tell me. And keep us posted. You have um, you have earpiece, right? Yes, I have okay. my, I have my, oh. yeah. Connected to uh, okay. headphones. Jeff, he said he's, he said he's been waiting here an hour, so he was probably here when we checked in. <laughs> Call him from like well, the elevator. Just yeah, I just so about to say it. Hold okay. right now, Great. so you can know everything was going right, on. Cool. But I know everything's going on. Good. I hope he was waiting here over an hour. Mm -hmm. Little rat asshole. 
Oh my god, ma'am. My manager is shouting at me, ma'am. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Why why did you hang up on me? Ma'am, I did not hang up on you, ma'am. I was waiting for you, ma'am, because I was speaking with my manager. Okay, 718 is the room number. Ma'am, he cannot come. Please, I'm requesting. I'm not going outside. Is are we done then? Ma'am, I'm catching your leg, ma'am. He's downstairs, ma'am. Please, ma'am, I'm catching your leg. Please. I don't know what the f- that means. Don't touch my leg. What the hell are you talking about? You're touching my leg. I'm begging you, it means, ma'am. I'm begging no, you. No, you're touching my leg. Is what the hell? I'm catching your leg. It means, ma'am. Don't say I'm that. Stop you. telling me you're touching my leg. It's freaky. Okay, seven one eight is my room. His box is here. I texted you the password. Ma'am, All you have to do I is say that. Ma'am, the problem is you have to come. I don't have to do anything. I'm on a call. I'm going to get on a conference call and start working. You asked me the room number three times. Can you hear me? Yep. Okay, perfect, perfect. Hey, you guys. I have an Asian guy standing here on his phone looking around. At the lobby? Mm-hmm. Okay, f- let's go get him. You don't want to see if he'll come to the room? Okay, let's try to see if he, yeah, a few minutes. Because the only real issue I see here is if you walk up to him and say, are you Josh? And he says, no, we have nothing. To no, I'm still going to choke him. Well, I'd rather you not. I'm keeping my distance a little bit. I decided to sit off to the side more because he's right at the lobby chairs. He will, he's standing, he's seating, what he's doing? He's standing right at okay. near the middle tables there. By little tables? Yeah, by the by the those middle tables where the those middle tables. Drinks. Oh, you want everybody have drinks? Okay, okay, yeah. sounds good. We we will try to sorry, we'll try to push uh, Chappy to send him to our room. Yeah. Good job, Pop Tart. You're doing amazing. Gracias. I'm the cover agent, Pop Tart. <laughs> <laughs> greedy bastards. I already sent cash from you. Okay. Hello. Ma'am, try to understand, please, ma'am, please. I don't care. Ma'am, the parcel needs to be delivered. Well, then, seven one eight is my room number. Ma'am, I told my colleague, but the colleague cannot come. They are not letting it enter. Try to understand. No, that's a lie. I uh, yes, say who? Who's not letting him enter? Tell me who. No, ma'am, he did not come in. Ma'am, you right. please just. I'm not going outside. You think I'm going to get freaking attacked outside? No way. Ma'am, I'm on the line. No, you're not going to be on the phone. I'm about to hang up, and I'm going to go to work. Ma'am, I will be on the line for two minutes. You just go downstairs and take I'm the not parcel. going downstairs. Ma'am, if you're not going to go downstairs, how can I get the parcel? Please you go to the door, go. the same as we, what we had planned. Ma'am, the hotel, it's not allowing. Yes, the hotel is too allowing. I just talked to the front desk. Why are you lying to me? Ma- ma'am, I'm not lying. The, the, the hotel, me. you are lying. I just spoke to the front desk. What? She, told you I just spoke to oh. the front desk and they said, nobody is asked. They said, we already told you you can have a guest up. So what What are you talking about? Ma'am, the, kid, the problem is they cannot come to the hotel. The service well, then, is out. That's your problem then. They don't have the permission. Bye. They, we, we I'll be back in two you. months. Sorry? I'll be back in two months. You'll back into, ma'am, are you kidding with me? We no, I'm not. Back. I'll tell you, I, I'm traveling. I've told you this the whole time. I'm not going outside. You, you think I'm crazy? Ma'am, there would be no trap. Do you outside. think I am crazy going outside as a woman by myself? Ma- only downstairs, not outside, only downstairs. What is he wearing? What is he wearing? What is he wearing? He's wearing, I'm giving you. Tell me right now, and where is he? Okay, I'm telling you, this way. Are you going downstairs, ma'am? Where is he downstairs? He's just downstairs. Where? Downstairs. In the lo- at the lobby? I'm not going outside with it. No, no, not lobby. He's just... All right, what is he the- wearing? I'm telling you, he's wearing a black co- clothes, like a black t-shirt and a black pants. Total black. Okay. Black clothes. And he's at downstairs. And he knows the password. He knows the password. Send me a picture. Send me a picture. Okay, let me send you the picture. Okay, Where he okay. Right now. You can go downstairs. Send me the picture. I'm not going anywhere until I see it. Okay, let me do that. Send Art, he won't come up, says Chappie. Okay, well... Oh. Pop Tart. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Chappie's saying that the f- not gonna come up. So then let's do that, find an angle that you can have uh, eyes on him and just watch me approach him and just uh, go with the floor. If he runs, just start running and Ashton's gonna be behind me. But that's it. 
Got it. He's standing, does he, does he have like any mask on, like anything, or his face is visible? Mm -mm. No, uh, no mask on. No mask on. All right, Ash, you know what I think? He looks like, oh wait, mm -mm. What? Okay, Chappie's saying 100% he won't come. You know the last time, the only thing that we got acknowledged because he didn't see any camera, camera was inside. Because if I have camera, that's definitely no-no. So the guy that I was watching, he met up with a girl and walked off. Unless I walk up to him. But there's another guy who just came and sat down right by where I was sitting, who's just by himself on his phone, so. Is he wearing a dark shirt? Any, anybody wearing the dark shirt? Any description, the one that Chappie said? Hold on. And maybe we can ask Pop-Tart to actually walk out outside and just like, you know, pretending to be on the phone, just look left and right and see if she see anybody on the parking lot. Yeah, I could always walk up to him and ask him if he's Josh. I'll zip this but up. But I just you have to say, you have to zip it. But I gotta know who he, which one he is. Yeah. Then just walked out when we parked the car and just look left and right and see if there is anybody okay. standing with a yep. black t-shirt. Yeah, we. You'll we, have to hang back with the stocking. Yeah. Until I. Yep. Until you're gonna give it the signal. Yeah, we are actually changing the plan. We're gonna send Ashton. He's gonna zip his uh, his shirt and he's gonna ask him, "Hey, are you Josh?" And I want that you will have a box like this. So that will be you. Like, "Hey, are you Josh? I have something for you." Let me quick peek outside for you too, just in case there's a better mat. See, ma'am, I have to send you a picture. Okay. That's outside. What is wrong with you? That's outside. Yeah, yeah I'm not going outside. That's outside? It's, it's the building, right? That's, That's outside. Building, right? It's outside. Do you not see the trees? Oh, I'll tell him to come inside. That's outside. Didn't you look at it? What are you doing? This is weird. Ma'am, ma please. Ma no, please nothing. Ma'am, this I will be on the line. You make, you, no, you will not be on the line. I am hanging up with you. Bye. Ma'am, why you are not doing it? Because you're a f***ing idiot. I told you I, he can come upstairs. You tell me he's downstairs. Yes, I send you the picture. Where outside! It's outside! Are there palm trees inside the hotel? Okay, let me let me tell them it's not inside the hotel. One second, let me tell them. Yeah, I'm just walking out here a little bit. So I can... He said he went to the washroom. Keep your eye on the bathroom. Keep an eye on the bathroom. Chappie said that he went to a uh, wa washroom. <laughs> Freaking, yeah, bathroom. Okay, well, I'm outside, so you want me to go back in? I don't see anybody else out here right now, though. And we'll be in lobby in five minutes. Yeah, he's sitting on his phone, but he's just sitting on the gray stools. On the gray stools in the middle of the lobby, right? In the middle next to the bar? Nope. Nope, this guy is sitting over closer to where we were, um, where we were standing at that, oh. that set of chairs. The check-in, like more to the right, right? Yes. The check-in? Yes, yep. He's not in the middle, he's all the way we actually confronted where the, the other guy. guy. Is. Yeah. Well, that's where the bathroom is. Yeah, that's right, that makes sense. All right, I think that's our guy. It's matching the script. Is he standing or sitting? Uh, he's sitting on the gray chairs with a phone, being on a phone. Should we go? Yeah, I think like, yeah, f let's go. I'll walk ahead and yeah. hang behind in that hallway. Uh-huh. And then if he tries to go, I'm gonna, I'll get loud. Yeah. No, I'm already gonna see it. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna see it. Yeah, but I mean, if he tries to move ahead, I'm gonna, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, just say, all right. Hey, you're stalking. Yeah. All right, Pop-Tar. Op Operation stalking, naked stockings activated. Ashton, I'm going to the guy first. Ashton so. is going to the guy. He's gonna give me a signal and then, okay. Uh, Pop-Tar, we're leaving now. Okay. I got this talking. Okay, so we have GoPro. Check your GoPro. Is your GoPro rolling? Check this out, Ash. Mm-hmm. Yep, it's rolling. All right. He's going to be on the right as soon as you're going to pass elevators. Mm -hmm. That hallway on the right, great chair. He's sitting on the phone. Josh. All right, Pop-Tart, we in the elevator. Film Ashton because Ashton going to lose the uh, his angle. Yeah. Okay, film him. Get ready to get loud. All right, pop guard. We at lobby. Okay. Okay. Mm hmm. All right. It's go 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 time. All right. Look at Sam. Ashton is walking right now. Walking okay. right now. All right. Hey, are you Josh? 
No. Josh? No? Okay. That's not him, I guess. That's the guy? That's not. Ashley's walking away. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. <laughs> He said it's not him. He said it's not him. But he's in the phone. Couldn't tell. I didn't see anybody else, but now that guy switched sides, switched seats. Chappie just said he switched seats. Okay. What did you just say? Diana's fried chicken. That's around the corner. What a f dumbass. Okay, okay. So it's not our guy. Uh, Chappie just said that he's uh, like eating some chicken across the street. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, sure. He was just in the bathroom. Now he's eating chicken. Hold on, pop tar. Stay in the lobby. We're going up. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to go anywhere. Okay. Yeah. Right. Well, I almost jumped the bitch. Wrong, wrong place, wrong time. <laughs> Josh? He looked at me like, no. <laughs> like, oh, my bad. <laughs> he got his chance with Ash, but, you know, <laughs> Ash is, is taking. Uh, oh, okay. fuck. He got a chance well, to get two girls tonight. How do you say you're in the lobby and then, oh, wait, no, I'm eating chicken? Because they f***ing scammers. They always do this shit. I know they're scammers, but like, are they you always stupid? All right, all right. And there is, there is uh, people checking in and they said, Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> they saw me and they said, Merry Christmas. Oh my God. F Josh, eating fried chicken across the street. What a f yeah, Dinah's chicken is down the road around the corner. It's like right over here. Should we... It's like a diner. What the f*** he's doing there? <sighs> Maybe he, like, because he was driving f for so long. Whoa, what's up? I just got really sweaty. You got what? You, you what? Slidey? <laughs> no. <laughs> sweaty. Oh, sweaty. Sweaty. I, I thought she said, like, I'm becoming really slutty. Yep. Down here in the lobby. It, is it drawing too much attention if I dance on the table? You're getting a lot of attention. You have a lot of guys. You're feeling, feeling a, lot of, a little bit slutty. Okay. Hey. Mm, mm -hmm, the, mm -hmm, the night is young. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, we, we're pushing Chappie to bring the guy back. He probably drove for so long. He waited us for so long. Now he got hungry. He went for f***ing fried chicken. He'll just have a little snack and we'll be there any minute. Yeah. He went for oh, okay. a snack. Okay, listen to this pop tart. This is what we got from this camera. Uh, he waited too long outside, so he went out for lunch. He'll just have a little snack and he'll be any minute. Oh. That's good because camera gonna be full. He was not able to run. run very fast. <laughs> <laughs> He's been waiting all afternoon. He's been here since four o'clock. That, that picture he took is full on afternoon bright. Yeah, yeah. He was here before us. Yeah which is not usually the case. Yeah, this is unheard of. Usually they f***ing five hours late. Mm -hmm. That's not, hold on a minute. That's an old picture. Where'd you get that picture? Why is it light out there? It's dark out here. What the hell? Ma'am, he was reading. What the hell? He was reading. Ma'am. What a liar. Reading. You're a liar. It's dark out here. You just sent me a picture of the daytime. Ma'am, he's waiting. I What I told you, he's waiting from one or two hours. He is not going to go now. He's going to go. If he's going to go, it I will be in a big problem. I don't care. I you could care less. Is, I, don't I don't care. care. Alright, I gotta I go. Care, if he doesn't I go know, inside, he's got five minutes. I'm going to the lobby. If he's not in the lobby, that's it. Okay, I'm gonna tell him come to the lobby, right? Yep. Yep. F he's so hot. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm gonna be a fried chicken soon. Good. Camera is hungry. Can you imagine like in the middle of like uh, robbing a bank? He was like, you know what, everybody, 15 minutes break. I'm hungry, then I'm gonna rob you after 15 minutes. Okay, Chappie said, this arrogant head is saying, send me a pic. Do you have a box you can take a picture in the lobby? And I said, We're, we have a box in the room. Can you come to Dinah's Fried Chicken? It's very close to your hotel. He's having lunch. <laughs> Honestly, that will be amazing. Let's go and do it. But we don't, there's a lot of variables there we don't know. We don't know what he looks like, we have no eyes. We don't know the, the environment. We don't know if his car is there. It, there's just, there's a lot that we're having a lot less control over what happens if we do that. Cause I don't remember, I don't know what that place looks like or how deep it is with the tables and how we're even the hell we're gonna find him. He might be watching us from a mile away. Oh yeah, there is a place, yeah. Diner. <laughs> Cause it's like a diner. It's, it's not like just like one counter where you order chicken. So he, we don't know if it's left or right, yeah. which table he's at, like, yeah, 
we could make enough noise just trying to find him that it won't even, yeah, he won't even f***ing identify himself. Ma'am, can you tell me? Oh my god. What? Listen, you have to tell me where you are right I now. I don't huh? have to tell you anything. I'm in my room. I, like, this is so friggin' weird. I'm headed downstairs right now to the lobby. If he's in the lobby, I'll set. If he's not in the lobby, I'm coming back up and I'll be back in two months. Okay? He's in the lobby. His name is Josh. He knows the thing. He's wearing black pants, black t-shirt. If I don't see him in there, then we're do all done. You have to come out there. There is no I, way. Okay, no. All right, then never mind. Okay, man, never mind. No worry about it. Yeah. Never mind. I promise you, I will put your job on Rick's from every way. Uh, that Remember makes no that. sense. Okay? You, I don't know why you had to lie to me about everything. All you had to do was have him come get the stupid box, and now I got to take the box with me. Leave it, ma'am. You don't need to give me the parcel. I don't need it. I, I know how to get it, okay? You what? I know how to get it, okay? I have it. There's no way for you to get it. Where is he outside? This is so ridiculous. Okay, I'm headed down there. You at the lobby? I am heading to the lobby. I am at the elevator. All right, I'm going down there. I'll call you back. As long as he has the password, I can get this done and get my go back to my life. All right, that's on the sending picture. <laughs> They're freaked. I sent Pick in the room. He's not coming back if he does not believe me. They are freaked. Of course they are. <gasps> no! Just said trilogy. What? So Chappie said, he said, F he just said trilogy. We should f***ing run to that fried chicken. We'll never make it there before he drives away if he knows it's trilogy. Maybe they're just trying to call the bluff. She knows what to do. She just pretends like she doesn't know what that is. Yep. Sometimes they say that just to see if we'll break. They might be bluffing. Unless they saw us down there. Maybe they weren't at Dinah's. Pop-Tart, anybody left since, since, since me and Ashton went uh, to the lobby? Did anybody leave? No. No. Uh-uh. Okay, so what happened between the little text before that and now? We haven't gone down since he said Dinah's. It's gotta be a, a bluff. Well, either way, this got a lot more dangerous. This just got a lot more dangerous. Because if the mule, kn mule I mean, obviously knows and could, you know, be more prepared than just an, a surprise confrontation. Just tell him that you're going to sleep in 30 minutes, his choice. What could have possibly tipped him off just in that span of time? Like if this whole time they believed it was real, what would tip them off between and Pop-Tart said nobody, nobody yeah. left, nobody anything. Well, how about like this? How about I'm, I'm, Amanda gonna come? She gonna go to the lobby, she gonna take a picture and she will come back. And when the guy arrives and he will say like, what is it? I need to use bathroom so we know he's downstairs. Wait, so he arrives and what? He arrives? He arrives to pick, like we're gonna be behind and the Amanda. And talks to her? Yeah, and we're gonna be behind the Amanda. How are you gonna hide? Dressed like that? In the corner. You're the one who's gonna walk in, you're gonna be uh, second, I'm gonna be third this time. She could take a picture of the box on her table down there. Yep. And then I'll sit at a nearby table. Yep. Okay. And I'm just gonna and be. She could even take a selfie if she's comfortable with it. Yeah. All right, Em, can you come? We will talk to you. Come, come, come to the room. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay, perfect, thank you. Okay, I will film you. I'm gonna call her. Hello. Uh, little f. No sh. All right. The hotel. I know. I know what it is. I just have that feeling. Yeah. Um, well, they're, they're still there. I played them. I said, I don't. I don't want to tell either of those restaurants. And he's gonna want to see somebody standing there. So if you guys can have her go down with the box and you hide somewhere, I don't yeah. know if they know her. I, well, there's a lot less likely. The person there with the box. Okay. So she's coming back to the room now. We're gonna give her the box. She's gonna go sit yeah. down. She's gonna go sit down there with the box. If she needs to take okay. a if she needs to take a selfie, she can, and I am going to okay. sit. I'm going to sit a, f a couple tables away, and then Art is going to hide further away because he's got a costume on. Um, and then as soon as someone walks okay. up to Amanda, okay. as soon as someone walks up to Amanda, then I'm I'm going to we'll approach him. Okay. All right. I don't remember. No. Oh, She's coming she right now. You're going to be uh, you're going to be a bait. Uh -huh. Samantha. Samantha. Is it Samantha? You should know your Karen. name. No, Karen is the victim, but you're, remember, you're here. Yes, yeah, Samantha, oh, yeah, Karen's yeah, yeah. been arrested. Oh, 
take a picture of it yep. on the table out there yeah. and text it to me. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go down in the elevator after you okay. and sit like a few, few tables away far from away, you. Far away, yeah. Okay. Not far away, I wanna be right there with you and then he's gonna be far away because he's okay. in the costume. Oh, yeah. So as soon as someone walks yeah. up to you, it's okay, go go. So they're gonna come to me and just then you say, guys will yeah, I'll be close enough to hear you. Got it. And if you say, "Are you Josh?" then, okay. then you know, it's on. Maybe it's maybe on. you okay. can even see it uh, so they would not recognize you. You can see it from the back I'll, by, I'll the, by, by the by uh, the by the bar. Sit like this. Well, I want to see though. I want to be see, able to see. see. I'll, I'll, I'll figure okay, it out. I'll figure find out. a spot. Will you have your GoPro going? Because it's... I'm not going to be able to probably film secretly and respond to him. Okay, what are we going to do? I'm going to give you one more GoPro that you can place it whatever how you want. Why? He can take mine if I can't film it myself. Oh, you want me to have it for if I'm coming after you guys and yeah, using it? I'll, I'll, no, I'll you, you keep your... Yeah. I'll you take get one, one of the in the room, because yep. he's not coming up here, so... Amanda, you first, Ash, you second. I will f*** off far away until you're going to give me a good I'm light. Leaving. Stay in eyesight of me. Yeah. And, uh... And Amanda, then you're gonna call me again, and then I'm gonna hear everything. Yeah, going yeah. On. I'll, as soon I'll as you yeah. get there, uh, take a picture of this on your table in the lobby. Yep. Yeah. Just so you can see the lobby, okay. and then text it to me. Okay. Okay. I have um, a GoPro. I'm gonna zip this up and follow right behind. Yep. You. Okay. You okay. guys go. Come on. Mm -hmm. Let's go, guys. I have a GoPro. Those bastards. All right. All right. Cheers. All right. See you in a minute. See you in a minute. You good? Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm sitting down. We need picture immediately. They they yeah, they're becoming I'm, quiet. I'm, I'm getting it. There is no communication yet. You see. Okay, Ashton sent the picture, and Ashton said, um, "We downstairs and we separately." Yeah. Uh huh. Okay, just keep waiting. Okay, and keep me posted if somebody is coming. Yeah, maybe a picture. Like, it'll be great to take a picture of you. Um, just um, uh, the. Yeah, um, I'm. I'm sending picture it now. of the. Oh, yeah, of the front um, front entrance. Well, I have so me next to. Yeah, okay. I have me next to the Christmas tree. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Um, I'm gonna send it to you. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Send in the group. Fucking scammers got quiet. Of course, which either means they got scared or they're here somewhere, nearby anyway. All right, all right, all right. Uh, so five more minutes, pop tar and we're going back to the room. Okay. Yeah, I think the game is over, to be honest with you. They, they're very responsive. If they went dark like this, it means they already know. Mm-hmm. Hey, if they f***ing draw for a couple hours, uh, from you know from different city okay that's they already wasted their time gas money person mm -hmm. so you know cannot cannot catch cannot catch them all unfortunately well you you cannot control that's the thing about our job is we cannot control an outcome or if somebody's going to show up or not you just have to take the jump yeah. and hope yeah oh yeah oh yeah 100 mm -hmm. percent. it's a f lottery she said nothing i left messages Okay, okay, doctor, going back room. Okay. Thank you. All right. I think they send a spot or something. Mm -hmm. They ch they f changing the game. Good job, Tart. Yeah. Oh, thanks. I mean, I'm just chilling. Yeah. We've been Waiting talking for shit Josh. about that's, you, Ash. That's, 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 that's the hardest part. That's the hardest part. Just stood sitting up. there when nothing's happening. Well, that sucks. Hey, don't. It's Please. no. It didn't suck. You know okay. what? This is still like I love these kind of like unpredictable cat and mouse. Well, Quests. Yep. Yeah, when we got that message that 
said no hotel, I was like, oh yeah, they know us. Uh huh. I think maybe they suspected Trilogy, but I don't think they're confident because nothing happened in that 10 minute period when he said, can you go to Dinah's Chicken? And then when he said Trilogy, like no, no movement happened. There's no way we got spotted in that 10 minute gap. And but, you know what? He was here like four hours ago because that picture <laughs> was during the day. So And when f drove, he spent money on gas. And I called him on it. Huh? He said it was like he was here two hours. I said, what? I said, I told you to turn 10 f***ing times. Yeah. Please leave your message after the tone. Ryan, it's Samantha. I'm back in the lobby with the box. I don't see anybody. I sent you a picture in the lobby. I have black pants on, a blue hoodie. I don't know either of those restaurants that you mentioned. I don't know the town. Karen's husband said just to go to the lobby with the box and give it to you. Thank you. Bye. I mentioned at the beginning of the video that it's getting harder and harder to get these cash mules to show up. And even when they do show up, they're too nervous to pull the trigger. Unfortunately, we didn't get a face-to-face -face confrontation with this particular cash mule at the Hilton. And this is something that we don't usually show in our videos. Now, don't worry, we still have an epic confrontation and chase happening in this video, so keep watching to the end. But we're showing it now because I feel like it's still an important part of the awareness of the scam process. And let's not forget, this scammer team has spent the better part of three days trying to get this money. And instead of the $200,000 they were hoping for, they got absolutely nothing. The scammer's manipulation game is on point. And it's extremely important to remind potential victims, especially our elders, to not ever allow themselves to be pressured into acting fast or acting in secret. And if you don't mind, Mrs. Hazel, sweet lady, can I ask you that how old are you? Oh, I, I'll be 80 this year. 80, my goodness, but your sound is so sweet. I thought I'm talking to a young lady. Around 45 to 50. <laughs> Not only do these scam baits take hours and hours to execute, but the vast majority of them don't actually show up anymore. And that speaks volumes to the hard work of scam baiters all around the globe. And for us at Trilogy, taking the financial risk to set up a sting each time is a risk because we never know what's actually going to happen, if anything. So even though we wasted a ton of this scammer's time, we just couldn't bring ourselves to let the holiday season pass without the satisfaction of a Santa Claus shakedown. So we had Chappie postpone the chap sizing so we don't burn the lead and decided to set up another sting, this time at a house in Long Beach, California. And we're not just going after one scammer. We have one, two, three, four, five scam baiters surfing the scammy seas to send as many cash mules to our front door as possible. Thank you for getting connected to Geek Squad. Thank you for calling Norton. Thank you for calling PayPal customer support. My name is Mike. How may I help you? This is Albert. How may I help you? This is John. How can I help you? Now, we have one epic confrontation and chase that's about to happen in this video. And it just happened to be a result of one of my baits, using my old man voice for victim Felix Fleming. But I'm featuring all these other scam baiters because this confrontation is a victory for the entire group. I received a message here that says I sent a payment for $589 to Coinbase Global Inc. And it says to call here. Hi, John. Um, I need to talk to somebody about the um, invoice. I think your company charged me uh, incorrectly for something uh, today. My name's Gary, by the way. And may I have your first and last name? George, George Wallace. My name's Hazel Zisman. So the refund amount will be $499.99. Keeping a scammer on the hook for this long is not an easy feat. And whether or not the cash mule actually shows up in the end is not in the baiter's control. Are you in front of your computer right now so I can help you with the cancellation form? Two year support. What, what is this? It will help you to cancel the service. So he's uh, connected to my VM. Uh, it says uh, child, oh gosh, has been found on this network uh, illegal activity has been found on network and a charge of fourteen thousand nine hundred and ninety nine dollars has been found on your identity by using your email and network what doggone it what is that doggone it oh my god oh my god sir what is what is this so massive shout out as always to our extremely talented peers deo modder paul moisty unicorns bull raxon and of course Chappie Gray for their relentless efforts and massive talents being used to better the world. The problem is your identity, which has been compromised, and the problem is the illegal activity, okay? This is but what they do to victims. The when they connect to their computers, right? they tell them so what we will this thing that he's do, telling me, that there's a all, charge, that there's to, child like, secure this porn on there. House. And then hit on submit. Okay, am, I all, am I all done now? Yeah, what can you see? Just read it back to me. There are 
request for cancellation amount of $49,999. Oh, my, oh my goodness, Jesus. <laughs> what do you have done, Mrs. Hazel? I put $499.99. Oh, goodness, Jesus. I think uh, my, you might have forgotten to put the dot or too many extra nines out there. I hope, Mrs. Hazel, you have not done it purposely. No, I, I typed in $499. Oh, you simply need to uh, go to your bank, okay? And you need to withdraw $15,000 in a cash form from your bank. Now, for the security purpose, oh, you will see your screen will go for updates. What updated. can you see now? Hold on, I have to... Let me restart my computer. No, no, don't Wait, touch it. On, don't I'll touch right it. Back. It is hold doing on. by the server. Hold on. You do not need to answer anyone's call till you don't complete the call with me. Is that clear? Just log into your bank. Okay, if you are new here, this is a and don't touch your computer. Fake bank. Okay? <laughs> this is not real. Do not tell your bank you have been hacked. Do not tell your bank you are facing identity theft. All right. So when they ask me why I'm withdrawing the $15,000, I can't tell them it's because I've, I've been hacked? So you can tell them it's a medical emergency or you can tell them I am investing this fund somewhere. I'm supposed okay. to lie to them? Then they will gonna you let me to lie to the bank? Let me tell you why you need to lie, sir, okay? The thing is, wow. uh, if you will tell your bank the genuine problem, like let you got you hacked why or you're you facing need to the lie. Theft case, okay? What can you see now? Oh, working on updates. Hold on. Okay, me, do not touch your computer. Com oh, Don't touch your computer. computer. Hold on. No, no, wait. Hold, hold on. on. It'll hold just on. Take a second. Hold on. Don't touch on anything. Don't touch on anything, sweet lady. I don't want you to do any more mistakes, okay? Bank does not have any information about this child. If they will get to know, like you got hacked. So I believe they will gonna freeze your account after that, okay? So, yeah, so now he's gonna give the headset to another scammer or supposedly transfer it and this other scammer is going to come on and he's going to give me all the details hopefully i can get some information here my manager is shouting at me my full body is shaking right now you can understand sweet lady grandma fifty thousand is not a small amount right and i trust you grandma if you receive the money you will definitely help me to get back the money right did you get back your normal screen i got an update from my finance team that the money is already there in your account can you see that international refund norton Oh my gosh. Can you see that? I see it. James, what do we do about this? This is Daniel Harris, the level 5 senior security officer. You just you just need to go inside the bank very normally and withdraw the money 15,000 and come outside and come back home and then talk to me, okay? That's all. You have received 49,500 extra money which is our company's account, from our company's account, from Norton account. I want you to go to your bank and take out cash. Can you do that? I told you that we are there and we will send someone to your place. Is that fine with you? And they will pick it up for you so that they can get this fixed, okay? But the man that actually shows up for his appointment to sit on Santa's lap is a cash mule from this fake PayPal invoice for a purchase of a Google Pixel 7. I'm using my old man voice as Felix Fleming. And considering we're already in the sting house today where time is not on our side, I'm attempting an entirely different approach to the scam bait. You can call it a fast track scam bait. I'm calling the scammers, telling them that I already have the cash that they requested previously. Basically, I'm pretending that all the previous scam baiting steps with the computer already happened. These scam call centers have so many employees and they're all using interchangeable fake names that there's no way for them to actually know who has spoken to who. So I'm calling them up pretending that I already spoke to Mark. There is no Mark. And you know what? Knowing them, there probably is a Mark. And as long as I'm confident in my story and I'm able to social engineer my way around any kind of computer access, I'm hoping their greed will get the best of them and they'll send a cash mule Anyway. Thank you for calling PayPal. My name is James. How may I help you? Hey, Stix. Can I speak to Mark, please? Well, you're speaking with Mark. Mark. How may I help you? Yeah, this is Felix. I have his cash here. Okay, wait. Hold on. Yeah, hi, sir. Uh, this is Mark. Yeah. Uh, so do you have a cash with you in your hand right now? Yeah, I got what you told me to get. 46000 here. All right, uh, so how much cash you have in your hand? $46,000? Yeah, you told me to get it at the bank and I got it this morning here. All right, so now uh, what you need to do, uh, are you at your home right now? Yeah, I'm back. I, <coughs> I ran my errands with my caretaker and I'm back now for the, for the mm -hmm. weekend here. All right, 
so like uh, did your bank ask anything with you like for what reason are you withdrawing this cash what have you told them you, yeah you told me to tell them i was getting it for a Chris, christmas gift for my grandchildren all right so they not told you anything like what they told you after that well they gave me the money it's my money so i i may have told them i want it all right sir all right so now what you need to do all right the cash which you have in your hand all right uh what you need to do first all right you need to uh click a picture of it all right first and i want you to text me the picture of the cash okay so that i can told you uh how you need to keep it with you so that uh, my banking officer can visit at your place and they can uh just simply take the cash so that we can resolve it right now okay the cash which you have in your hand all right keep that cash with you all right it's 46000 dollars correct so what you need to do sir you need to take out uh 1000 dollar from that cash okay i want you to take out 1000 dollars and keep it with you first okay because uh you need to buy uh one box do you have a lock box like any kind of a box with you uh so that you can keep the money inside the box and the money should be we're safe so that we can collect it safely uh we don't want our money uh to get compromised so for that reason for uh, the safety i want you to take out $1000 all right from that cash all right first and can you please tell me do you have any lock box or any box where you can set up a pin and put the money inside the box no i, I don't have a lock i just have a cardboard uh... Like Amazon box in the garage here. No, you can do one thing, all right? Uh you can just simply take out $1000 with you and keep it that with you because whatever expense it is going to take, all right? Mom, I want you to pay no, it from There's no my... expense to have. I've got the cash here. I can't leave the house again until my caretaker comes next Friday. I thought you were going to collect the cash from me here. All right, no worries. Just wait for a moment then, okay? Oh, yeah. I want you to just uh help me out uh, with your address, with your information, all right? Oh. So just wait for a moment. I can send my banking official at your home and they can collect the cash easily. Yeah, Long Beach, California. Just wait for a moment. Just uh give me a moment, okay? Oh. Hold on for a moment. I'm all right. I'm going to go tinkle. So I need to I'm going to use the restroom here. All right. If you would like to have a uh would want to have a glass of a water or a cup of a tea or who would like to have a glass of a wine, just have it. I need and something give me something stronger than wine here to calm me down over here. Thank you for your cooperation sir and first make no make a note of my direct dex number if by any chance This line gets disconnected. I want you to call me on my direct text number. So just make a note of it, okay? Yeah. And this is the only number I can reach you, sir, if the line gets disconnected by any chance while we are talking to you. Yeah, I'm 94 years old. I don't need multiple phone numbers here. Hold on for a moment. Give me 5 minutes, all right, yeah. so that I can help this information out. Okay. To my banking off skills right okay. now. Okay, toodle. All right, thank you. Just hold thank on. Thank you. Yeah, toodle. All right. Yeah. yeah so bye. just bear yeah, with me and ahead. make sure yeah. the line doesn't yeah, get disconnected. Go, go ahead. Bye bye. Answering. Uh, yes, sir. This is Mark. Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. All right, this is my number, okay? Yeah, uh, you yeah. don't need to hang up the call. Yeah. All right, I'm just having a word with my banking manager so that I can uh help out with your address to them and they can get at your home and they can collect the money easily, okay? So just wait. Yeah. Don't hang up the call, okay? Just hold on. Yeah. Right. Just relax. All right, just sit in your couch. All right. Oh. I'm just talking to my banking official. All right. You don't have to go anywhere. They oh. will come at your place, all right? Oh. And we are going to collect our money cash. 
Yeah. Okay. When are they coming by? Uh, I've, I'm just having a word with them. You need to give me 10 minutes, all right? Yeah. Then I can let you know the official timing. Yeah. So meanwhile, just uh, sip, uh, have your wine, all right? And yeah. just get relaxed. All right, you toodaloo. Sir, are you disconnecting the line? Yeah, I thought you were done here. What, what is it? I don't have all day to sit on the phone with you and shoot the shit. I just want you to uh, hold on, all right? You can leave your phone as it is, okay? Uh, I'm going to need you uh, within 10 minutes, all right? Then I will let you know. So keep your phone on. Don't disconnect the line. Don't hang up the line, all right? Well, I don't want to waste all my minutes on hold. What the... Just call me when you... God. All right, God. then I'm going to call you after 10 minutes, yeah, okay? Yeah, fine. God. All right. All right, thank you. All right, Bye. Doodle, doodle, doodle. Yeah. Yes, sir. This is Mark here. Yeah. All right. I had a word with my banking officials, okay? And they're going to visit your place uh, within uh, one hour. So what I want you to do, okay, because uh, they need to make a verification uh, so that they can uh, come at your place. So I need a driver's license of yours. Do you have a driver's license with you? Son, I'm 94 years old. I don't drive. I want you to just simply get in front of your computer first and turn your computer on, okay? No, no, no I told you I'm not doing any more computer Rigamaram nonsense. I have your cash here and I gotta take my nap. So what are we doing here? You need to be sitting next to your computer. I'm not so that going I on the computer. Help. We spent all goddamn day on the computer yesterday. So that money, uh, we are gonna take it with you. My banking officer are gonna come at your place and they're gonna collect that money. All, all right? right, then let's do, do it. That. I got it. I got shit to do here. I'm not turning yes, sir. For on the computer next, here. There is a yeah, there is one work left. You don't have to do anything. You just need to be sit next to your computer I'm so that I can I'm not going on a goddamn can. computer, Mark. Quit saying that. I'm done with this shit. I've wasted a day and a half of my life here. But I'm promising you, sir, you're not going to waste any more time no. within an hour. I have this the work cash is gonna get here. Completed. It's in my hand. Here, right here. I have it. Let's get this done with here. Yes, sir. I am understanding. So how I gonna get? I need a picture of your driver's license so that they can identify you and they can come at your home and they can collect the money in cash. Mark, with I don't. You. So I need. Mark, I don't have a. I'm on a flipper phone. I don't know how you're supposed to. Just I gotta take my nap. I'll leave it on the porch for God's sake. I don't give a shit. So, sir, I just need any identification of yours. I don't know. So that I'll my show bank it to the guy. When he shows up, he can look at my ID if he wants here. I don't have a camera to photo texty schmexty. I'm 94 years old, for God's sake. Here. I'm understanding, sir, what you're saying, okay? But my banking officer wants one ID of yours. So that they can identify and I can they can come well, then directly at the He phone. can see it when he gets here. We'll have a password or something. I don't know what to tell you, Mark. This is not a normal situation, so figure it out here. So first I'm gonna help you out with the password, okay? Which should be only me, uh, you and my banking officials, okay? So once I call you I want you, you to tell me what the password is. I'm gonna let you know. You need to ask me for the password. So our conversation password, make a note of it on a piece of a paper, okay? Yeah, what is it? It is an apple, fruit, name of a fruit, apple. Apple? Yes. A P P L E. A lame ass password, but fine. All right, I'll see you soon here. Okay. Yeah. But address is in. Hey. Hello. Yeah. 
Yes, sir. <laughs> what is so, the password? I, the password is Apple. Good boy. All right, sir. Thank you for your understanding. You're a smart guy. You're an honest guy. Whenever I call oh, you, you need to ask me for the conversation password. Oh. And this is my only number you need to talk to me. Apart that. from this number, if you get any unknown calls from any different number, don't answer that number till the time we collect yeah, that cash. Yeah, I got okay. it. I got it. And if <coughs> anyone pretend to be Mark, you don't have to talk to anyone. All right, sir? What time are they coming by here? Uh, what's the time in your place right now? Uh, it's about quarter past ten in the morning here. I just want you to help me out with your complete address of your apartment so that I can give it to them and they can come at your place. It's not an before apartment, it's, it's a house. Don't you have an address already here? Long Beach, California. And your zip code is 90802. That correct? Is, that is correct. I want you to take out $1,000 and keep that $1,000 with you. Okay? That is a compensation from my company for the inconvenience. It is a small gesture we are providing to you for your honesty and your cooperation. Wow. Okay? Thank you very much. Keep that. You are welcome, sir. You are so humble and an honest guy. If suppose someone else was there uh, instead of you, they should have been, they must have been ran away with my company's money. But as you know, that the money which you got with you, it's our company's money. And it is not too easy to run away with anybody's money. So as if you are an honest guy, you are a legit person. For your honesty, I'm helping you out with one thousand dollar okay yeah well uh, you know honesty and integrity is what it's all about don't you agree absolutely absolutely sir this is all about our i would prefer 1500 if we're being honest here but you know whatever absolutely sir thank you very much for your time and patience what time are they coming here honesty. so i know to be dressed uh, within uh, one hour, okay? What time? Uh, till 12 o'clock. That's two hours. Okay, that's two hours. They will going to be at your place before 12 o'clock. I need okay? to know what time. I go to the bathroom often. Okay. Uh, just give me a moment. Exactly. Give me an exact time so I'm ready here. <coughs> All right. Uh, they will be at your place at 12 o'clock. At 12. Uh, one hour, 45 minutes from now. Yes, sir. They will directly come at, to you and they will talk to you. And I will let you know what the password is. Okay. So they are going to ask. You need to ask them what is my password. Okay. Yeah. So if you give. Uh, if they give you the right password, then only you need to give that cash in their hand. Oh. If they tell you the wrong password, you need to let me know. And you do not have to give the package to them yeah. until and unless they give you the right password. All right. Toodaloo. Uh, beg your pardon? Toodaloo. All right. So, sir, uh, if you don't mind, sir, can you please hold this line and make... Answering. Oh. Yes, sir. This is Mark. You all right there? All right. So the password is Apple. Yeah. A P P L E. P P L E. And I'm asking. All right. And I'm asking you, sir. Uh, can you please help me out with your full name, like your first and your last name, your full name? Mark. Did we We've been talking for two days and you don't know my goddamn name. Yes, sir. I know it. I just need to confirm so that I can give this to my uh, banking official, the exact name of yours. So that is why I'm asking you this for the Felix. full name if you have. You should know this is Felix Fleming. Mr. Felix, I know your name, okay? I know 
but I need to make sure, Mr. Felix, so that I can once I transfer this information completely, okay, so that I can make sure that I don't miss out anything, okay? Yeah. They are gonna come at your place, all right, very shortly. This okay, is a so PayPal, please. PayPal employee, all right. Yes, sir. They are PayPal employee. They're officials of right. PayPal. Terrific. Okay. All right. Toodaloo. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, sir. This is Mark once again. What is the password? How are you doing? The password is uh, Apple. Good boy. A P P L D. Good. So, sir, uh, my banking officials have left their place, okay? Yeah. And they are coming at your location, at your home, very shortly, okay? So, have you took your medicine? No, but I gotta take it soon. Is it the same password to Apple for them here? Yeah. Yes, that is the same password, okay? Oh. Once they come at your place, I will let you know, okay, what my banking official is wearing, okay? Oh. And you need to look them. They will be just at your doorstep. Oh. And then uh, I will be online with you, talking to you. You need to pass this call to them, and I will talk to them. Then... You need to ask them for the password, oh. which I give it to you. Yeah. You need to tell that what is my password. Yeah. If they gave you the right password, yeah. then only you need to give that money to them. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Yes. All right. So, totally. All right. Bye. All right, bye. Answering. Yeah, hi, sir. This is Mark once again. Oh. So, sir, uh, like, uh, my banking official is going to reach soon. So, one thing I want you to note it down, okay? I want you to note down he is going to carry $1 with him. That is a password as well, okay? for the surety and there is a serial number of that one dollar note okay yeah you need to make a note of it on a piece of a paper okay so note down it's b as in bob yeah. then number six yeah. four four again yeah Three, eight, then number zero, seven, six, then D as in David. So, sir, are you first use the bathroom, okay? Yeah. And then I'm going to call you. Yeah. After five minutes. All, All right. right. Toodle -oo. So that worked, but it looks a lot easier than it is. I actually had to call several scam numbers to get to this point, resulting in a ton of unused scam bait hilarity that won't be in this video. Head over to our streaming platform, TrilogyPlus.com, or just download the app, Trilogy Plus. You can create your free account and start watching a bunch of bonus content. You'll find an extended and uncensored version of this video with tons of unaired scam bait shenanigans from our Stinghouse. Oh, calling me. Yes, sir. This is Mark once again. Yeah. How are you? I'm fine. All right. So the password is Apple. Yeah. You have note down serial number, correct? Yeah, I got it here. Uh, once my banking official come over there, all right, he is uh, going to give you that one dollar note, okay? Yeah. And you need to match that number is the number which I gave you, is it matching? Yeah, with I, got, that serial I, I got it, I got yeah. it. I'm not stupid here. And can you please tell me what dress are you wearing so that I can tell to them and they can identify you easily? I'm the only one in this house, Mark. There's no need to pick me out of a lineup here. Just have them come up to the door, I'm here. Can you just please help me out with the color of your dress? Oh, it's uh, black, and I, I'm wearing my hat. You are wearing a hat? Yeah, I got a little white hat on. That was my favorite white hat. hat my and fa favorite. What 
dress are you wearing? I got a dark shirt and, and long pants here. What is your, your, your uh, representative wearing here? I'll let you know uh, your white hat. You're wearing a white hat. And what the dress you're wearing? Like a, it is a t-shirt? Yeah, it's just a shirt here. Yeah, what's the color? Dark, dark like black here. Black? Yeah. How far away is he here? He is gonna come at your place very shortly, okay? Right. So you need to be prepared and get yourself ready. Yeah, I'm here. And don't change your dress, okay? Yeah, yeah fine. And you're, you're wearing a black t-shirt? Oh, I don't, I don't know why that matters. I'm the only one here. Yes, sir. I know you are the only one there, but I need to make sure for the identification that my banking officer wants me because you haven't shared your driver's license to me so that they can verify you easily and they can collect it. Okay. Right, fine. So you are wearing. Oh, uh, is he almost hat. here or not? I gotta take my medicine here soon. Okay, you are wearing a white hat and a black t-shirt. How many times okay. I gotta tell you? Yeah. Oh God. And what's the color of your pants, sir? Oh my God, Mark! I, got, I don't have time for this. Just have him get here soon, so I can just knock on the damn door. Yes. I don't know what's so hard about that here. Yes, sir. Uh, like for that reason, I told you for your time and patience and your cooperation. Right, well, I'm running I'm out. Giving you one thousand dollars to you. Please keep that money with you. Okay. Yeah, all right, you fine. Just need to give forty-five thousand. All right, toodaloo. Yes. Hello. Okay, I'm getting a call. Yeah. Yes, Mr. Mark. Uh, yes, sir, this is Mark. Yeah. All right, Mr. Felix. Yeah. What I want to tell you is that my banking official is going to reach at your doorstep within 10 to 15 minutes. Okay? All right. I tell him to hurry up. I got to take so my medicine. They are hurrying it up. And probably within 10 to 15 minutes, they'll reach at your doorstep. So I hope you are also ready. Correct? No, I'm fine. Just call me when he's here. All right. So I'm going to call you once he is there. Within 10 to 15 minutes, I'm going to let you know yeah. by calling you. Okay? Yeah. yeah. All right, Mr. All Mark. right. Total Bye. Take care. 10 minutes. Oh. Calling me. Yes, uh, Mr. Felix. Yeah. The cash which you have with you, have you put that cash inside any bag or you oh, need to God. keep that cash inside the bag, sir? Yeah, I put it in a little uh, box. Or, uh, little box? Yeah. How the box looks like? Like, what's the color it of the It looks like a box. What difference does it make? Or what kind of question is that? Like, what is the color of the box? It's a brown box. Oh, my God. It's a brown box. All right, sir. Is he and here? Yeah, do you have any... Is he here? Lock? Yes, sir. He is reaching there within 10 minutes. That's what you like said 10 minutes ago here. I would like to ask you one last thing. Is that... Is the box have, like, a key, a lock, no. key, or just a simple it's, it's a box. cardboard box. Stop wasting my time. Call me when he's here. All right, sir. <laughs> Dipshit. You've already said they don't listen. No, they're so goddamn stupid. There is a SUV that is pulling over right now. It's a SUV, SUV Toyota. Yeah, I see it. Driving slowly, slowly, and he's going behind. Yeah, he was looking. It's okay. He's. We'll see if he's driving or he's. Um, or if he's looking for parking. We'll see. It's all right. I will keep an eye on him. Yeah, the guy went all the way at the end of the street and okay there is a guy walking but i don't think it's our guy okay it's walking okay there is a jetta pulling up someone right just parked right is right behind you yeah i see it i see it i see it behind us yeah i see it where do you see the black suv it's way back there it has its hazards on yeah yeah i see it now There's yeah there is another suv coming there is another suv yeah they searching two people exiting i don't think this is our people no, they're going across the street. Okay. Yeah, that's the f***ing SUV. Yeah, this is him. This is my, it's our mother He's trying to find parking. He's circling. Yeah, that's our guy. 
Come on, come to daddy. Daddy is waiting for you. He's probably gonna park right behind you. Uh-huh. Yeah, he's looking for a parking. All right, I need to tie my shoes to get ready to f***ing run. Uh, he went down the street and he's trying to find a parking, right? Yeah, I think so. He went in front of this. UPS. Next to UPS truck, yeah. Yeah, he's circling around. He's sniffing, he's sniffing. But I'm pretty sure that's the guy. Yeah, I can f***ing guarantee you. I can f***ing guarantee you that's the guy. It's gotta be him, dude. He drove he by slowed down street. twice. He looked at the door. He looked at the house. He turned around, he came back, and he continued was looking only on the left, not on the right. So he was looking for the house. The good thing is that SUV ha uh, had only one driver. Yeah. It was no passenger. So... Uh-huh. Bet you he's gonna call me any second now. Yeah, Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Do you still see that SUV? Because right. he turned left, right? Yeah, but the SUV behind us. They're turning now. I don't know if that's the same. Is thing. it him coming back? It might be. He just turned. He turned left. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see, let me see, let me see. No, no, no that was a different woman. And she was driving way too fast. I have a feeling he found the parking and now we are gonna walk. I know. So that's, yeah, we gotta look up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you walk straight. I'm gonna walk behind. I'm gonna watch your ass. Okay, somebody's walking. Someone's yeah. Parking. Yeah, I see. I see somebody's walking. Here, wait. Somebody's walking. Up. Yeah, that's the guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Get ready. Get ready. That's the guy. That's the f who who been in the car. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Okay. He's looking we got him. He's trying to find yeah, area. yeah. The beach is here, guys. Asian guy wearing a hat on a cell phone. Get ready, guys. Okay, careful. Don't move a lot. Uh huh. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, bitch. Yeah, go, 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 go. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on. Look at him. Look at him. He's keep looking, but why are you passing? Come on, bitch. Yeah, scratch your balls. Oh, that's our guy. Come on, bitch. Walk inside. Trap is waiting for you. Yeah, I can guarantee you. It's, it's our guy. It's our guy. Yep. Okay. Okay. He's looking. He's observing everything. He's observing everything. Okay, stir the phone. He's looking for description of the house, but he already know that's the house. Come on, bitch, go inside. Go inside, you fucking little asshole. Come on. Come on, you greedy bastard. Yeah, okay, okay. It's okay, let him walk. Yeah, he's here. He's calling me. He's fucking here. Oh. Yes, Mr. Mark. Oh. Uh, yes, sir, this is Mark. Oh. Mr. Felix, yeah. can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. All right, so my banking official has reached your doorstep, okay? Oh, I have him come on up here. Open the door here. You just need to go out. Oh, I, I can't walk. He's just, just have him come up the steps here. Oh, you need to get out of your home. I He's can't. There. Mark, I can't walk. I, I can I'm at the door here. Uh, oh. Just need to go at the doorstep. He's not going to enter your house. You're not allowed. I can't walk. Hello? Is anyone there? Hello? Uh, so, where is your caretaker? Oh, they're, who can they're, carry yourself? They're all gone. I only come once a week here. What is his name? His name is Tom. Tom? Tom? Yes? I can't, I can't walk. Tom? I don't see anyone here. Uh, hello? You're just out of your... I'm, I'm on the, uh, outside the front door here. Where is he? You're at your front door? Uh, door's open. I'm standing here. Okay. Just need to come out. I, uh, do you have any garden? It's a front uh, porch here with yellow chairs. And there's a, a red car and parked in front of the house here. And it is a red car? Yeah, right in front of the house here. 
right in front of the house. Oh. Hello. Where, where is he? I don't see anyone. All right. Just hold on. Oh. Here we go. Uh, oh, hi. Is that a PayPal? Yeah. PayPal, yeah. You have the password? Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's a dollar bill. Oh, that's terrific. Uh, that's the cash. Is uh, hold let's on. Go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, hold on. How much is it for here? What? The PayPal, right? Yeah. Yeah. What about a PayPal is going on here? Huh? Uh, hello, Tom. How you doing, fucking Tom? Hello, what's it? What? Good what? morning, uh, Tom. Good morning, Tom. Look at this. Him got the phone. Him got the phone. B six four four three eight zero seven six D. What's going on? Huh? Talk to us. You? you want to go to police what? or you want to talk? Huh? You want police? We'll tell you. Why are you doing here? What are you doing here? Huh? No, no. Don't do that. What are you doing here right now? What are you doing here? You speak English fine, I just sit heard down. you. Sit down. Huh? Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down over here. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. What priest? Priest not gonna help you. Sit down over here. What are you doing here? I fucking sit down. Listen to me, huh? Don't wanna talk? Why are you here to steal money? Why are you here to steal money? Huh? Can't you fucking skin stealing people, huh? money from Steal old men? What are you doing here, bud? Let me go. Go Let ahead. Go. You can do whatever. Don't touch me. Hey, yeah. Excuse me. This is my property. Don't push me. Huh? What's going What's on? What's up? For what? Huh? Talk to us. You want police? People, huh? okay. We're going to police. Let's go. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. wow. What Get about him. these? Where's oh. he parked? <laughs> Where are you going, Tom? Tom, you're not going to escape. Escape what? For what? Escape. Okay. I'm, I'm you came to scam people. You came to scam people. And you know that. I know English. Merry Christmas, bitch. Merry Christmas, bitch. Merry Christmas, bitch. Uh, what's up? No. Whoa. Merry Christmas, huh? Your Christmas is gonna be in jail. Jail. In jail. Yeah. American jail. Okay. Okay, okay. Merry Christmas. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. F you. You just got into the trap and now you're going to the prison. Yeah. Are you outside yeah. your house? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. You need your shoes? You need your shoes? Yeah, Let's go, your shoes. I'm here. Okay. I'm here. We got your plates number. Yeah, is this him? Tom, We're calling is this police. you? Oh, yeah. Say hi. Is that you, Tom? It's Tom. No, don't touch my phone here. Oh, you, Tom? Tom? Here. Yeah, this is Tom, right? Mark? Oh, Tom. Yes. Yeah. Tom. So, Tom, you want to comment on why you're here to steal $46,000 from an old man? Huh? Uh, Tech support what? scammer on the run in Long Beach, California? Huh? Oh, oh, shit, yeah. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down over here. Sit down over here. Sit down over here. What, what, what the f? Man? What the f? No, no, no. Sit down over here. You okay. want to talk? For what? Put yeah. it, sit down. We can talk. Talk what? We want to know why did you came to steal money? Why are you here? You came, you came $47,000. You came to get I don't four? know. I you don't had know. password. You had a dollar bill. I don't Who know. Sent you? What do you mean Who you don't know? Don't be stupid. Just you some, just somebody just asked me. Then why are you running? Why are you running? Why are you, you running? You just taking the back of it. Yeah, because this is my running? house. Don't, don't touch me. Fucking, don't touch don't us. Don't touch our equipment. Because I want to know why you're here to steal money. Why are you tech support scams? You're here to collect $47,000. I don't know. Yeah, you do. I don't know. Then why are you running? Why are you running? You don't know where you run. You're gonna be exposed to the world. I don't know you FBI do. is gonna be informed. You're reported. I don't know you do. Yeah. You don't know. Okay. Well, we can play this game all goddamn day, Tom. Tech support oh, scammer, a Tom. Lot of money. I had the, I a lot of money. Money. Anyone ever had an elderly money. grandma get scammed? This is the guy doing it. Huh? Anything to say for yourself, Tom? Oh, Tom. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Nowhere to go, huh? Santa Claus. Oh, oh, he oh, swings. Oh, swing and a miss, motherfucker. Move. Wow. What a move. Wanna go to the store? What a move. You wanna, you wanna go get some gift cards? You wanna fight? Or Mark's no. gonna fire you? No, you don't wanna fight? So why are you doing move like this? You don't wanna fight? Huh? Okay. Oh, he's deleting it. Oh, uh, of course he's he deleting is. conversation. Of course he's deleting it. From Instagram. Oh, he knows what the f Telegram. Look, look, he's deleting oh, it. Telegram. Wow. Oh, what a f 
fucking shocker. You're cleaning evidence. Here You're pick cleaning up evidence. Cash from an old man. What was? It's how you hide. Ho, 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 ho. What was that? A hook? When I was like three years up after your dog. That's what we're trying to do here. Take the shit home. Oh, so good. Take the shit to the garbage. So good. Filming everything. Yeah. Oh, look, look. You have a chance. Of course he's deleting everything. Oh, no. Oh, deleting what? Oh, wow. Oh, telegram. This is incredible. You know, there's a police station nearby. What happened to your flip flop? Brother, how was we gonna, um, you know, Christmas coming, right? <laughs> oh, we, we had a gift, jingle bells. Scammer? Oh, but wait, don't touch me. I'll smack you across your face. Touch me one more time, I swear to God. You are not in a position to dictate rules now, Tom. Fucking stealing money from grandparents. So he's got no flip flop. Where's your car, Tom? Are you broke, bitch? You have to steal money from old people to survive? Oh, now you want to talk? Oh, you call 911. We're not the ones breaking the f law right now, you dumb mother. How we This is Trilogy Mania, huh? Come on, let's How public do you want to take this, huh? How public do you want to take this, huh? Let's go. Huh? We can walk this way, that's fine. Anything you want to say for while you're stealing money from people, huh? I think he's a flip flop. His nickname is a flip flop. A flip flop? Where's your flip flop? That that uh, that jumper looked like it hurt, huh? Did it hurt? Yeah. Looked like you broke something, maybe. Yeah. Might need some medical attention. You bet. No Anything insurance. Anything you want to say? No insurance, because no he don't work for Trilogy Media. Oh, oh, Tom. He's deleting all the pictures. Of course he's deleting everything, because he wants to delete the evidence. Oh, Mother fucking Tom. It's gonna be the new fucking catchphrase of the neighborhood. Fucking, do you know Jack? He's deleting all the messages. That's okay. We got his identity. We know, we know his identity. He's so Tom. What happened? Oh, you want to run? Oh, bad choice, bud. You're gonna lose. <laughs> You're gonna lose. <laughs> what the fuck? You look so stupid. Oh my god. You need a scooter? Ash, you need a scooter? Oh yeah! What is your flea yeah, flop? Yeah, take the scooter. Tom, what is your flea flop? We need your flea flop. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. Tom, what is the flip flop? We need that flip flop. Holy shit, Tom. Wow, wow. And we got your plates number. We see your car. Prison is waiting for you. Tom! Oh, I'm so sorry, Tom. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Tom, Tom. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit, what the f? Tom, what's happening? All right, here we go. Get your flip flop. Let's go. Let's get your flip flop. Oh, yeah. Oof. Come on, Tom. Oh, be careful. Where's Tom? Oh, 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 so Tom. What's happening, Tom? What's happening, Tom? Oof, oof, oh, Tom. Oof, oof, oof. I'll be careful. Oof, 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 Tom. Oof, Tom. Oof, 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 Tom. Thank you. Get your Toyota, Tom. Fucking A. Whoa. Chasing scammers. Here we go. Oh, we got his license plate. Even better Washington. Oh. I sure hope. Get out. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Oh. Huh? Tom. Don't want to talk anymore? Bye, bye. Is your door locked? Oh. Tom, bye, bye. I'm going to follow him. Bye, bye, Tom. Bye, bye. Come on, Tom. Bye, bye. Where are you going, motherfucker? It's perfect. Hold on. What are you doing, Tom? Hold on. Hold on. B as in boy. T as in Thomas. D as in David. 6332 Washington Park. Oh, good. Oh. Oh, this car. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, wow. Here you go, Tom. Huh? Oh, Here you go, Tom. Tom. Oh, you Bye. motherfucker. <laughs> see you, <it>, Tom. <laughs> we'll see you at the police station, you motherfucker. <laughs> Let's go. F***ing <laughs> in there. Oh, f***ing Tom. Oh. Where's Santa Claus? F***ing Tom. Okay. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Scooter! <laughs> I've always wanted to make it happen. Finally, we got Scooter! It fucking worked! <laughs> Shut the f up. Oh my god. Ding dong. Oh my god. Ding dong. I can't high five you. Blah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't ride with one hand. You got fing Scooter. I love it. Oh uh, yeah, I always wanted it to happen. Fucking Tom. Fucking Tom. Fucking Tom. Fucking Tom. Scammer's calling me, so let me get back to the house. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the scammer. Up. Hello? 
Hello? Yes, sir. Edit will wait for Yeah, who's this? What happened? Yes. You good? This is, this is Mark. Hey, Mark. This is Felix. Yeah, this is Felix. Where are you, sir? Huh? Where are you? Oh, I'm just, I'm just putting your mule in prison. That's all. Your cash mule. He's f***ed. Oh, and where is my, where is my brother? Where is my brother, Tom? Who's your, your Who's lethal your brother? Your brother, Tom? Spam? He is so f***ed. It's not even funny. Thank you so much. You have given the parcel to Mark. It's with Tom, sir. Tom has nothing but a big dick in his ass. He didn't get any cash because this is a setup, you dumb mother f Stop scamming people. He didn't get his... No! What a f***ing idiot! Money. Idiot! Comedy call, Comedy Central. See if I Hello? Yeah, yeah. What happened here? Yeah, yes, sir. Where is Tom? I don't know. I think I got hacked. I... Oh, wait, that's Tom. Oh. He's getting a lobotomy as we speak here. Can I speak with Tom? Sir? Yeah, he's right here. <laughs> I got caught! Trilogy Media put yeah, that's the situation as I know it. Yeah, you gotta send another guy, because Tom over here is inebriated over here. No, listen to me, sir. Yeah. I don't know him also, okay? Like, he's just a worker. You said he was your brother. Are you lying to me here? Please leave him. Please leave him, sir. I should let him go. He's chained up in the bedroom. Hey, shut up, Tom. I have him uh, restrained and naked. Should I, what do I do with it here? Can I call you on a video call? Can I call you a video call? Yeah. Can you show me his face? Well, if you show me yours, yeah. If I will be in the US, nah. I will f your whole family member, you son of a bitch. With, <laughs> with what dick? Tom's naked here, you can Run have him. Me. You want Tom? Dick, you you can have Tom, his dick's almost as small as yours. Please, boss, boss, help me. Tom, boss, shut up. Help shut up, Tom. Me. Help me. Mark, what are we doing here? Mark, what are we doing here? You good, bro? You are the stupidest. I've talked to a lot of scammers in my life. I think you're the f***ing stupidest one. Huh? Well, I don't speak. I don't speak noodle. I don't speak noodle. I don't speak noodle. You've been speak, true immediate. Speak English. Insult me in my language, otherwise it makes no f***ing sense to anybody but you. You're basically jerking off in the mirror right now. Speak English. Oh, I heard that one. Okay, well, good one. What else you got? I'm not working in that point of time. If I will be working that point of time, then nothing just such The only you're working is doing is hooking on the street with your mother. So stop scamming people. Do you even realize what has happened to you today? I know, I know. I understand the situation, but he's just working on a two-person, okay? Okay. Well, now he's working on getting his hands unrestrained because he's tied up in my bedroom right now and naked. Please leave him, sir. Please no, leave him. no. I think I'm gonna do some experiments. I have a key rig. Can I, can I, I got can plastic. I, can I hurt his voice? Let's see what else. Don't yeah, he's in the back. Yeah, you hear that? Tom, shut up. I have a cactus. I have a. I'm gonna see if I'll put his dick in the microwave, see so if it can no. possibly get any smaller. No. Can I? Yeah, I will give you five thousand, sir. Please. Okay. Leave Send it. Right Send it to my PayPal. Go ahead. Your people account, you mother for for what? Five thousand, or are you just gonna do that for free? Are you gonna grace me with your Tic Tac? I will f your whole U.S. country, you son of a bitch. Your Tic Tac won't last one half. F How are you gonna f have you however many f billion people we have? Put my dick in your mouth, you son of a bitch. I can't find it, f face. If I was gonna do that, I'd use it to floss. I'm not going to put your dick in my mouth because I have to find it first. Boss, please, boss, help. You can't do a shit. You Tom, a spread shit. your what cheeks and no. shut the f up. Not Tom, in my shut hands. the f up. Put it in. Not in my put hands. it in. Good no. boy. Good boy. All right. Any other requests, Mark? Mark, you want to tell your whole call center? Tell your call center that you just got Trilogy Media. I think a few of them might know what that means. Please leave, please leave, Tom. No, I'm not going to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some shit to him. I'm gonna do some bad illegal things to Tom. What do you think? A picture of Tom? Well, it's kind of bloody. I don't know if you really want it. It's it's a it's a little bit uh, disturbing. Yeah, give me a you're, of you're what? Which you position know. do you want him in? I will bend him. Which one? He's actually more flexible than a chunky guy. He looked a little like me, and I'm not flexible. But Tom can bend. Give me a picture, you 
So how a, a picture of what? So you can save it? What? Save it to your camera roll? What this good is a picture gonna do? Why don't you just come join the party? Take a picture and then on the back of it you can write, I've just been truly media I am a dunce. What do you think about that? I am a dunce with a tic tac for a cock. Listen. It couldn't possibly be any better if it was scripted. I'm so sorry. It was FBI. It was a Homeland Security and Trilogy Media with a strap on. And it's right now inside of me. All right, we got his location <laughs> tracked, everyone. Wrap it up. Tom, go f yourself. I'm so sorry. I let you down, boss. I'm so sorry. No, 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 no. You hear that, Mark? I want you to beg for his release. I want you to beg. And I'll let Tom. Well, actually, Tom is not working with us. You not anymore. Are... You're right. You got that right, motherfucker, because he's tied up in my bedroom right now. He's got his hands up in the air. He's got his feet with a little crisscross applesauce, but his knees are pointing to the east and west. And he's got a fucking piranha sucking on his Tic Tac, trying to get every little piece of juice it can, but it's still fucking coming up hungry. Huh? Beg me. He doesn't. Beg me. He doesn't have much time left. He doesn't have much time left. You better hurry. I want to hear you beg. I need bail money. Please bail. Me. Shut up. Give me a picture of Tom. Give me a picture of Tom. Beg me, beg me, bitch. You are my bitch. Give me a picture of Tom. Give me a bigger dick to play with. This is the best you can send me? Why? Huh? Mark. Mark. Can you possibly be this? Can you possibly be this stupid? I didn't actually think it was possible. You are the dumbest mother I've ever exchanged words with. I know your call center's listening, you have me muted, but you can hear me. Trilogy Media just fucked your whole operation. You lost a Los Angeles cash mule and $47,000 today. How do you feel? Does it hurt? Do you need lube? Or is it just like, like dry bone today? We were going for dry bones, but I'll take whatever I can get. In this case, I got a mule in my bedroom, chained up. Sobbing. I'm gonna run some experiments on him. I have a new uh, medication, a new uh, torture uh, method I've been playing around with. It's not FDA approved, but it is gluten free. Tom, put it in your mouth. Put it in your mouth. Give me a picture of Tom. Beg me, bitch. Beg me, bitch. I charge for that. You'll see it on OnlyFans if you subscribe. He's not doing anything. He's sitting and relaxing. Oh, he's doing something. He's doing something and he looks like a star. Give me a picture of Tom, you're lying. <laughs> I'm not lying. I took his Tic Tac dick, I stretched it. You know how you take a piece of gum and you pull it out of your mouth? That's what his Tic Tac dick looks like, except it's wrapped up you're behind lying. his asshole. And then the you're tip lying. is in the Give hole. So he's literally f***ing himself. No. Give me a picture of Tom right now. You're lying to me. Okay, send me Boss. money. Send me money. Boss, please save me. Send me money. Please. Or Can beg I... me. Or promise me you'll never scam anyone ever again. I'll take either of the three. Can I talk to my boss, please? Okay, I'm giving you a promise. I will just leave this job. You'll leave this job if what? Can you please listen to me for a one minute, sir? Yeah, go ahead. He's not work with us, sir. He's a, he's a receiver. He just earns the money. Yeah, but... Two person or a one Well, person, then that's you it. should feel bad because you put him in this situation. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I have done a wrong thing. I know. Yeah. Yeah, I know. So here's what I want you to do. I'll, I'll, I'll send you a picture of Tom. I want you to stand up in your call center and say, mm -hmm. you know, we are f***ing scammers and we just got Trilogy Media. If you say that really loud, I'll do anything you want. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I will give it to you. Go. Give me a picture now. No, you Thank have to you. do it first. This, what, do you, what do you think? You have leverage right now? Give me a f***ing break. Can I talk to him for one second? Hold on, you can talk to him. Hey, boys, I deleted, I deleted Instagram, I, I got out, group, Telegram, everything, three Telegrams, all the pictures, everything that I've done, like the previous packages is gone. They have nothing on me, but unfortunately I got caught. Please, please, for the mother of my dick. Oh, he's not even on the phone, he hung up. <laughs> <laughs> he hung up. You didn't do what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to scream. I, we are scammers, and we have Trilogy Media. If you scream it in your call center right now, I'll do it. Go. Okay, I'm, I'm doing it. Go. Give me a minute. Go ahead. Hey, all of, all, go and tell all of Buddy 
to stand up and tell we are a scammer. We will not going to scam anymore. Louder. Tell all of the person. Yeah. Tell louder. Tell louder. Louder. You gotta scream. We are a scammer. Louder. Come, come over here. Come over here and tell him. Tell him. I'm louder. We are. A, I tell me same thing together. Okay. Go ahead. We are a scammer. We will not do it anymore. Again and again. Again and again. Okay, and say I we bow down to Trilogy Media. We bow down. We worship. The, we worship Trilogy Media. I want you to say that. We worship to Media. Trilogy Media. You got to say it right. Trilogy Media. No, okay. No, we worship Trilogy Media. We are just ten plus. We are just ten plus. Ten plus pastor. We don't know much English. <laughs> yeah, you're fine. Your English is fine. I've been talking to you for two days. Say, we. Hello. Hey. Yes, sir. So have you leave my brother? I thought he was just a receiver. You said he wasn't his your brother. Right. He's like my brother, sir. Oh, okay. Because he keep flip flopping. So I wasn't sure what the. No, your brother is. No, your brother is still tied up. I've covered his entire bo body in chipotle cheese, and uh, I got a bunch of rabid dogs licking it off. Huh? What? Your video name, wait. My what name? You are a trilogy media, Randy Galaka. Oh, did you finally figure that out? Okay, sh shut up, Tom. <laughs> my, my, my attorney is coming in your house. Wait Let's, and watch it. Send him. Send him. <laughs> I got cash for him. Huh? Are you, how does it feel to be trilogy media from a first direct person, you know? My attorney is coming, sir. Wait for an yeah? hour. Is your attorney Tom? My attorney, yeah. No, no, my attorney is there. Kevin William, he's coming right there within a 30 minutes. Yeah, can you hear me? That's very good because this is me, Vlad, the tall f***er that nobody likes. Send all of them. I'm gonna f***ing chop. I'm gonna chop them all. Send them. The Russian mafia is waiting. Yeah. Send his. Send your attorney. Send everybody. Bitch. I'm gonna f***ing chop them. Break them. Watch me. Watch me. We already f***ed your mule, we'll f*** your attorney too. Let's go. You have a, you have a four or five people in your house. We are watching you right now. Yeah. Very good. Wow. And you know I'm watching you because the Russian mafia protecting this neighborhood. This block is occupied by Russians. You can't do a shit with my Tom. You can do whatever the f*** I want. Your Tom is already f***ed, so... Then, then if, if, you, if you are fighting with him, then you don't want to... You can upload the video, you mother because you know, oh, I will. people also catch. That's why you're not uploading a video, you motherfucker. You're just uploading a. Oh, I'll upload like, it. You're just going catching him. You're just you're doing a what? You are doing a ladies thing, you know. You when someone is coming in your house, you're going and you're going walk. You're just running and going to catch Let's him the him person. Let's send him a picture. And you're going to fuck. come in. You come my house. Which and the picture going of to him that we busted? Tell him. him Sit in my uh, sofa. <laughs> Sit in my sofa. So what, what are you going, saying going right now? You're acknowledging that you're fucked and were tricked by Trilogy Media? It sounds to me like you're admitting that you're fucking stupid. What do you need? You want a picture? I'll send you a picture of Tom. Listen to me. Listen to me, you motherfucker. Go ahead, you bitch. Do a shit with Tom. Go ahead, bitch. If he, I will see a single scratch on his face or anything. Oh, he's got more than that. Then I will going to show you. Oh. Then I will going to show you. Bring it am. on, motherfucker. You're the one that knows where I am, you coward bitch. Come on, bring it. Bring it, mother. I'm sitting here waiting. We are coming with a ten pupils. Do it. You have thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. It's a long flight. It's a long flight from Kolkata. Thirty minutes. Thirty days, bitch. But we're here for thirty minutes with the Russian mafia. I know you're in Kolkata. I've already tracked you. You're you're f dude. Just cut it out. Where, 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 where? Father you know where? exactly where, and that's for me to know and for you to not worry about. Or do. I don't really give a shit, but it all is going to the CBI and the FBI. You I know, I know. Oh my god, I can do so much cry more. Cry me a river, cry me Indian river right now. Did you subscribe? Attorney. Did you subscribe? Attorney. Video is, is the video is uploaded? No, I gotta edit it, you dumb f Not everything's as instant as your love life. Yeah, just send your attorney. One week to upload your video, you son of a bitch. Yeah. It will take you one week to upload the video. Yeah, because we got to edit it. We have to actually put effort in and do something legit, unlike you who just steals money from people. Anything else you want to say? Then you can do, you do one thing when you are, when you are just uh, bidding with him. You can show me a video. Why you can't upload the video, you mother 
but because you know you are also shivering okay that's why if you will upload the video you are bidding him then you will also going to be cash that's why you dumbass yeah i'm quaking in my boots <laughs> you know, yeah you're really scary you're lady, you yeah you're really terrifying with your high pitched indian accent listen come and fight with me hand to hand you mother you're the one that's got my address, bitch. Bring it. Come on, I'm waiting. Why I will come? Why I will come, you motherfucker? You won't, because you're a f***ing coward. Because you're a coward. I have... You're a coward. I have the full army. I have the full f***ing army of Russian bastards, criminals over here. Bring your criminals, I'm gonna show you my criminals. And see... And see... Show your... Show your face. Show up, or otherwise you're a little coward bitch. You cunt. You can't do a shit. You're a sister you Sister f***er. We also have a million of dollars in our company bank account, you son of a Well, you got 46,000 less today, mother You got 46,000. Your people and your parents, your mother, your mother, aside from being a f***ing slut, is ashamed of you. She's ashamed that you were even f***ing born. Your daughter is doing that, dude. I'm f***ing your daughter. She's in Kolkata. Well, I don't have, I don't have a... Don't fuck me okay, <laughs> keep going, keep going. Oh you're just handing us content you know, at this you're point. A, you're, a, you're a Kaylee, you're a Kaylee. Keep, keep making uh, sounds, it's, it's good content for us. You're only helping Trilogy Media and worsening your own cause. So keep going, I'm good. You son of a bitch, you can't do a shit, you mother... I already did. Where's Tom? You don't know. You have no idea where Tom is because he's not replying, is he? Tom, Tom will go on. Tom is gone now. Mm. He's gone out of your scam circuit. That's for damn sure. Anything else? You can't, like, say shit in noodle and then end it with an insult and expect that to hurt my feelings. Give it to me, f***er. I dare you. You son of a bitch. I hear, I don't hear an address. Where's the address? I don't hear an address. I hear a little pussy squeaking and, and panicking. A pussy that's f***ing panicked right now and has no idea how to fix the situation. Whose boss is so f***ing mad at you, you're going to be fired for giving out all this information about your call center. Oh, now he can't even speak words in either language. You're a f***ing disappointment to your boss. You're a disappointment to your mother, to your society, to your culture, to your country. You are a f***ing waste of... I already did. I already did. I'm on my way, but it takes a few minutes. I already did. You f***ing waste of carbon dioxide. Get a real, get a real f***ing job, you pansy, pussy, bitch-ass mother -fucker. Get a real job. You can give me a real job. I wouldn't hire you. I would rather hire a f***ing demented squirrel than hire yo ass. A f***ing monkey with dementia would do better job than you. What does that mean? Is that you dribbling your boss's cum? What are you doing? What is that sound? Take the dick out of your mouth. Remove it from your throat. Stop admiring it and have a conversation. Or just hang up the f***ing phone. Like you're not accomplishing anything other than giving us more content. So, thank you. Bang, 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 bang. I don't know what that means. Bring your criminals, you got 30 minutes. Where's your attorney? I don't see him. I'll give him a f***ing parking spot. <laughs> Come on. We'll open the gate for his ass. Yeah, I didn't think so. I didn't think so, yeah. I don't know what that means. So it means nothing. It means nothing. Just like your mom when she moans when I f her in the ass every night, it really does nothing for me. I'm bored of it. Okay, he hung up. You <laughs> <laughs> said I'm sitting my fucking. A journey! A journey! Yeah. Yeah. Is this Kevin? Hello? Yeah, this is Kevin. Who the f is Kevin? Kevin, I have fifty thousand dollars now. Tell me what I have to do. What are you talking about? Is this Kevin William? He's supposed to send me the money by the UPS. Are you lost? Where's your attorney?
I have the cash with myself. What do I have to do next? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't need your cash. Hey, you son of a bitch, you motherfucker. Huh? Was that, hey, a, son of a bitch. was that a joke? Because it wasn't funny. Hey, you motherfucker. Who the son of a bitch you are? You called me, you dickless Hey, Is that all you called me to tell me that? Hey, Randy, I was a very storm. I will give him. Tom is Tom. still in my bedroom. He's tied up and he's fing losing his mind. I'm just playing Baby Shark on loop for him. Hey, you son of a bitch. He's just a, stu a student guy. Leave him alone, you mother. Well, he's, it's, too, it's too late. He's losing his mind. He's in a permanent baby dick to do to do loop. And where is, where is Mark? You're, I thought you were Mark, you dipshit. This is Mark's phone number. <coughs> where is Francis? Felix? Where is Francis? He's in the bathroom. You want to talk to him? Yes, definitely. All right, hang on. Felix! Whoa. Yes, sir. Where are you, sir? I'm here. Have you made a wire transfer, sir? Uh -oh. What? Have you made a wire transfer? Are you uh, some kind of, of a stupid? What is stupid? I have the cash now. Tell me, you mother what I have to do. What? <laughs> what are you? I don't understand your gibberish. Here. Here, take, take the phone. Cash, Hello? Well, then pay your mom for the good time you had last night. Leave us alone. What do you, you want? Tom. What do you, you Thomas? <laughs> How many times I gotta tell you? I have Tom. I texted you a picture. You're never ever going to catch Tom, Tom bro. Dude, you Tom is already <laughs> here. He's naked and restrained. It's me. I'm here. You are lying to me. You I sent you a picture, you dumbass. I haven't got it, you asshole. Wow, well then again. I'm Let texting it again. Me. I just text it again. Boss, I need bail money, Let boss. Me look. Let me look, you mother Are you Let me look, I haven't got any pictures, you son of a bitch. You know what's funny you is it... To me, I love that you've been thinking about me since since Tom arrived. Like, this whole afternoon. <laughs> boss, Are you going to leave the Tom or shall I call the attorney? You call, I thought your attorney was coming already. He hasn't shown up. No, he will not come. He said that. <laughs> he's on a meeting. Hey, <laughs> he's, he's giving me like 20 seconds to talk and listen to me. So everything, like I, I, I got you, boss. Like I deleted Telegram group. Everything that you taught me, I did it. It's me, Tom. He making me do things that I don't like. <laughs> there is candle situation happening. He dripping on me. The hot candle on my asshole. No, he said he's gonna do horrible things to me. He's very unpleasant, trilogy media guy. <laughs> Rescue me! Trilogy media is not pleasant to me and my body and my soul. I need a bail money, boss. I do anything. I'm gonna work for 10 years for free. I don't want to be American prison. They give me juice. They are a liar, Tom. They are a liar. No, I'm not lying. It's me, Tom. I'm not lying, I swear. He said I'm going to go to American prison. And, and I have to go to the gym. And I have to drink Coca-Cola. I don't like it. And they have apples for breakfast. And I want to go to Indian prison instead. Tom, they both are, they both are wrong. What? Who is wrong? I don't want him... No, I, mean, I swear, it's me, Tom. I am the f***ing cashmere rat. I know, Tom. Yeah, I remember you told me the password, apples. I'm, I'm the one, he captured me. American captured me in his bedroom. And now he's putting candles in places. Why are you going to run away from there? Because I'm, I'm short. My legs are short and my belly is heavy and my ass is heavy. I cannot outrun Trilogy Media. No, they already called police. We're waiting for police. Tell them to I will not work this.
interesting anymore. Please leave alone. Doesn't work like this in America. They're gonna prostitute me. I mean, prosecute me. <laughs> Can I give you your money? Yes, please, please, please. How much? How much? Uh, American asking for five grand. About five hundred. <laughs> About one thousand dollars? No, five. He said he gonna let me go for five. Five thousand? Yes, I'm expensive, bitch. Okay, okay. Let me speak with the head manager, okay? <laughs> yeah, talk to manager because he has sixty nine more candles to burn on top of me, and I'm such a hairy monster. He burning every single hair on my body. What are you doing right now? I am suffering from candle in my asshole. Tell him to leave you alone. Like he that. don't want to do that. He enjoying. It's truly to me that they were unpleasant. Okay, I'm making I'm sorry. Deciding some ideas. Okay, talk about Please pay the ransom. Talk to this American nasty trilogy guy. I don't like them. They so un underdog. Talk to him, talk to the guy. <laughs> I'm gonna suffer. So anyway, that's the situation as we know it. Oh, hung up. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> I'm suffering, I'm told. Oh my god. He said, why don't you run away? Tell him you're not gonna do this anymore. <laughs>
You are the devil. Afraid. That's what you are. You are the devil. Okay, you got to whisper your insults because you're too afraid mommy might hear you. Same you same are nothing same. but a sack of sh You're wrong. I do something for society. You're wrong. I'm educated. I help people. I don't hurt people. That's what you do. How do you help you are a now? nobody. I help people by stopping motherfuckers like you from trying to steal from them. That's what I do. I fucking make sure assholes like you and your money mules go to jail. That's what I do. Why would anybody want you? You can't even transfer the phone. You're too stupid to fucking edit the HTML. You have to ask somebody else to. That's how pathetic you are. <laughs> ha, 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 that's all you got to say is ha 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 cause you're scared you're a scared little boy and you should be scared you know why not from me not from the police not from the CBI cause you're not big enough you should be scared that when it comes to the end of time that you're going to hell that's what you need to be scared of. You should be scared of karma. Okay, when karma starts and people around you start getting sick, when people around you start getting hurt, it's because of you. It's your bad karma. I don't hear you, you little sack of sh**. Do you know why your boss doesn't like you? Do you know why your boss laughs at you every night? Do you want me to play some audio of your boss talking about you specifically being a loser, being the lowest paid? Why are you the lowest paid? You, you are not it. smart enough to f***ing not piss on the floor when you're trying to piss in the toilet. So how does it feel to be the embarrassment of the family, the embarrassment of the office, the embarrassment of your country? Do you know what your country thinks about you? They disown you. They disown you. I talk to your countrymen every day, you fucking little coward. Your own countrymen apologize for scum like you. And you know what I say to them? Hey, don't worry, honey. It's got nothing to do with India. This little boy is the devil. And karma is going to fuck up his whole world. And do you know how many of my team you have spoken to, you stupid f the last 12 were with me, okay? All those packages, what do you think happened to them? Which the f***ing, all of them, you idiot. The ones in New York, the ones in New Jersey, the ones in California. All of them, the ones in Virginia. Shall I keep going, stupid? Shall I? Because trust me, your boss is so pissed that when we recorded him the other day on the phone talking about you, you better be worried. He said he knows where you live. And if a video comes out with you in it, they are going to get you. Well, get ready, boy, because you're about to be a star. Get lost. Oh, get, is that what you got? Get lost? Really? Again, you've yet to achieve a word bigger than four letters. You know how, how the call center owners pay off the police? But you know what they don't do? They don't protect their little f***ing freshers like you. You're what they call a fall guy or a fall boy. You're the one that the shit's gonna come down on because they don't care about you. We don't care about you. Your parents don't care about you. Your family doesn't care about you. Why Nobody you? cares about you. So you know what's gonna happen? You're gonna take the fall for the fucking idiots that you work for. Are you good with that? You're the asshole that's gonna wind up in a very ugly prison in India. And you know who's gonna save you? Nobody. And don't ask for info because I don't give it to little freshers. Just like your boss doesn't tell you anything, neither will I. Just like your parents don't tell you when they're getting together with your brothers and sisters because they don't want you there. They're embarrassed you might show up. And if you're comfortable living that type of a life with people... <laughs> ah, that felt good. Please leave your message after the tone. What happened, little boy? I thought you were so tough. You're so tough when you try to threaten old women. Where are you now, boy? Are you digging a hole to live in? Because that's a life you've set up for yourself. You are a disaster. You are an embarrassment. You are scared. And you should be scared. And if you don't go tell your mother, and if you don't go turn in that f***ing call center that you work for, you're going down. 
And guess what? Your mom is the next call. She's going to be a star too. Won't that be wonderful? When you're the reason that your boss and your mother and you are big stars. Isn't that what you always wanted to be? How disgusting are you? You're not a man. You're not even a boy. You're a f***ing toddler. That's what you are, a toddler. Let me explain to you what a toddler coward means. Thank you. I think I should call back and finish my message. And I will. The number you are trying to reach is no longer in service. Merry Christmas, Trilogy! Merry Christmas, boys! Thank you so much for watching this video and supporting Trilogy Media. Also, don't forget to do your free browser scan and try Guardio completely free at guard.io slash Trilogy. Your online safety depends on it. And lastly, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel here at Trilogy Media. We also have a second channel now called Trilogy Vault, where we're going to be uploading all of our funny short form scammer calls from our live streams. So if you're looking for a quick laugh or some Trilogy Media nostalgia, head over to Trilogy Vault and subscribe. Thanks again for your support. Have a spectacular rest of your holiday season and we'll catch you in the next video.